Welcome into the Player Spotlight presented by Sanderson Farms. I'm Erin Summers, joined by tight end Jawan Johnson. Jawan, it's year two going into the tight end position from wide receiver. Yeah. This past game, though, you did two receptions, 46 yards in that fourth quarter comeback. Mm. And I saw you out there blocking a lot of people. Yeah. How much more comfortable are you in yeah. that role? So much more comfortable. Uh, I just feel like, you know, just knowing the offense and uh, getting comfortable in it and then being that's the Guys like Trout and Taysom, uh, those guys helped me along the way. I feel like he's in me a lot of confidence, knowing that I can go out there and get the job done. Other than all the food you got to eat to put on weight, <laughs> what have you liked about this tight end role? Uh, I liked everything about it. I mean, I feel like you have to be so smart to play the role. I mean, you have to know um, what kind of technique you're going up against. You have to know the linebackers. You have to know the safeties, the corners. You have to know so much that goes into a tight end. It's probably one of the hardest positions in football. So. You know, just knowing all that and taking it all in, you just gotta have fun with it, and that's what I've been doing. You had a birthday recently. Oh, yeah. So, happy yeah. belated. Oh, thank you so much. I, I heard that your wife threw a little surprise party for you after the game she on did. Sunday. She did. How much fun was that, especially after the big oh, win? Oh, man, I feel like I was really surprised. Um, I mean, I didn't expect so many people to show up. For me, I never really had a birthday, even a surprise at that. And so uh, just going up in there and, and seeing my friends and seeing my teammates and her friends and why that I felt why. So it was so fun, had a great time, and it felt even better celebrating it after a win. You have the Bucks, another Absolutely. division foe that's coming here in the yeah. Superdome. Yeah. What's it going to take to get a win? Uh, it's going to take everything. It's going to take definitely all 11 guys. It's going to take all 46 guys who's playing on the, uh, on the roster that day. So it's going to take all of us. It's, I mean, they know our game plan. Uh, we know their game plan, so it's not really a schematic thing it's, it's really just who wants it more and so uh we know that we're not just playing them once this year we're playing them twice or even three times wherever the case may be but we know we have to go out with a winning kind of set the tone for the rest of the year 